What's going on everybody? It's Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer, and I am sorry for the absence, but I'm back with another episode of Buzz on the Battlefield. This is of course Battlefield 1, and I have joined a random lobby here on Sinai Desert. Of course, on my ever familiar horsey, and it has been so long since I've played this game, I hope I can remember the controls. Uh, I do play on console, and uh, yeah, let's have some fun here. I'm gonna head on down to D, and Looks like I have my first victim of the day if he stays right there. Oh, I still got the timing down. Yes! Get off these things. Uh, horses on Sinai Desert are really wonky. So, yeah. Apologize for the absence away from my uh, Buzz on the Battlefield series, uh, my Battlefield videos. Battlefield is the itch, uh, excuse me, is the, the scratch to my itch for PvP. Uh, I do mainly, uh, I guess, specialize in uh, Division and the Division franchise for all of my content, uh, informational videos, weapon reviews, things like that. But when it comes to actual PvP, I am a Battlefielder at heart and I absolutely love this franchise. Uh, I have not played 5 uh, and that's what I was going to discuss today. 5 is finally done. DICE has uh, announced that uh, they will not be updating... Oh, here... <laughs> Oh my goodness, uh, they will not be updating uh, any more, I guess, uh, maps or anything like that. Uh, it's basically five is being is being terminated. Uh, so maybe if you do play five, which I don't, uh, maybe leave in the comment section below. How do you feel about that? Uh, I still dabble into three, my absolute favorite iteration in the franchise. Four wasn't bad, didn't enjoy as much as three. Uh, I do play one, which you can see, uh, and mainly enjoy the horses, and uh, I absolutely skipped five. How did I miss that guy? Oh, and I roadkill this guy. This map uh, poses unique challenges in that there's a lot of topography that... Ooh! What? Did y'all see that one? Was that a double kill? I got one with the horse and one with the lance. Uh, anyway, back to what I was saying. Uh, this this map, oh my god, uh, poses unique issues in that there's just so many little things that the horse likes to bounce into and it throws off the trajectory of where you're going. Oh my god. My grenades and bombs from above and the tank still lives. Light tanks I can handle, the, the land ship, the creepers and stuff, I don't have grenades back. It takes about 13 seconds, damn. Um, oh, I should know better than this. And then I absolutely whiff on the grenade. I told you it's been a while since I played this game. Need to heal up. There we go. Come on, what could two horsies not accomplish on this game? <laughs> I should just shut up and just... Oh my god. And I'm throwing grenades too. I told you it's been forever since I played this. Oh, don't get killed by the truck. Are we still there? Oh, and somebody else road kills him. Good lord. Yeah, this game is just, it's wildly epic. In case you never experienced Battlefield, this is Battlefield. Vehicles, air cover, artillery, small arms fire, huge maps, spawning on squad mates, bullet drop. I mean... You name it, it, it's in this game. It is in this game. As EA says, it's in the game. Well, as DICE has said, it's in the game. Although they're not going to say it anymore with Battlefield Five. Oh, there's another victim right there. Let me go for him. Still don't know how I feel about that. Oh, yes. I love it when they're just running. Just completely oblivious to anything behind them. Still don't know how I feel about it. DICE is such a... They have such a history with this game. I mean, this is their game. This is the game. Oh, this guy heard me coming. He's got his headphones on. Oof, he shot a grenade at me. So, I'm not... Oh, yes. In case you don't know, you, gotta, you actually have to uh, toggle the button on the controller to switch the strike side of the lance. You have to pick if he strikes on the left or right side. And then kind of get the horse lined up. Ooh, they shot the artillery cannon at me. Anyway, those strikes over to the left side, they take some practice. Because he has to literally stand up in the saddle. Has to bring the lance up over his head and then strike downwards into the left. Uh, those take uh, quite a bit of uh, practice. 
Anyway, back to the dice issue. Still not sure how I feel about it. Can I get this guy? Oh, no. He moved. Um, Battlefield 5. Yeah, you just couldn't get into it. I follow some uh, some people on Twitter and uh, some other people on YouTube, and it seems to perform a little different on PC than it does on console, although it seems to have problems on both. Um, issues with enemies just animations just not even spawning in you can't even see them um, which on a game like this is bad wow they're getting pissed off at me I keep making these circles on them and trying to back rage their spawn so anyway um, going back to the vision uh, I don't really put much faith into uh, PvP and... Oh, that was a stupid move right there. That could have cost me a li my life. Uh, I don't put much faith into uh, PvP, actual organized PvP in the Division. First off, I struggle with it anyways uh, because uh, third-person PvP just it just throws my eyesight off. It gives me a headache. Whew, that was a good one right there. Oh, can I get this guy? Are you kidding me? Oh my God. In case you didn't see what happened there, I ran up on him. He threw the anti-tank grenade as he was dying. It hits the tank, bounces onto the ground underneath my horse, and kills me. Okay, I'm probably going to cut out the section where I wait for the horse to spawn back in. But I'm back on the horse. Uh, it looks like I have one... Yep, there he is. Wonky, wonky. Oh, I got lucky there. Um, anyway, I want to cut out the section where I'm waiting for the horse to spawn in because it takes forever. Uh, but I'm back, and we just took somebody out on F. So now we're going to recapture F, which is closest. Oh, my God. Stop bombing me, please. It's just me. The amount of people that play Battlefield that claim to know exactly how to understand what's going on in Battlefield, and then they don't know what's going on in Battlefield, uh, mainly speaking of uh, looking at the direction and the colors of the control points that we're taking here, or the flags as they're known of as. Um, obviously, if things are going in counterclockwise direction, that means you're taking it uh, back from the enemy, and then it turns to clockwise uh, when the fact that you're actually taking it for yourself. And I still get bombed and shot at and all sorts of stuff when I'm on a flag taking it for ourselves, and I'm getting shot at by teammates. Ooh, there's a horse. Let's get some horse-on-horse -horse combat. He's shooting at me with a rifle. He doesn't know what's going on. Yep. I could tell that. If you know what's going on with a horse, you don't start pulling out rifles and shooting. You go right at the hand-to-hand -hand combat. So if somebody starts shooting at me with a rifle while I'm on horse, I pretty much know I've got the advantage. As I said, probably not my favorite map to be riding a horse on these days. Uh, Ballroom Blitz is actually a lot of fun. I like that one because I can just run through the corridors and roadkill things, but still, this is an epic map. Really, really epic map. Um, I haven't found these kind of maps in Battlefield 5. Uh, I had these maps in 3. Uh, of course, Battlefield 3. Strike at Karkand and all sorts of... Oh, my God. I, I can't get started on 3. That'll get me emotional because that was just... That was the game. I can't tell you how many hours I spent in Battlefield 3. Ooh, more victims out here. And they're just laying prone waiting for us. Okay, so we're going to go for the medic first. If I can get him. Nope, missed him. This one's going to throw explosives at me. Uh, Roadkill him. Alright, so we got the assault player. So all we have to worry about is the medic. Can I get the medic? Something shooting at me. Oh, somebody spawned in on him. It's going to turn into a harvester. Here we go. Round one. There's number two. This is fun. Are they going to keep resing each other? Three? <laughs> Come on. Oh, he jumped. That was a weird, like, lag spike. So that's three out of it. Can I get this one? Four. <laughs> there we go. And there's a tank three miles away shooting its light machine gun at me. Come on, man. Those kind of moments in Battlefield, those are only the moments you can have in Battlefield where they just keep resing each other instead of taking out the underlying problem, which is me. They just keep rezzing each other. Look at this tank. It's just sitting out in the middle of a sand dune. 
that is called not playing the objective. In Battlefield, you always want a PTFO. He is not PTFOing. Or she. I can be sexist. It could be either. Alright, so they have a dreadnought out. This is bad news when you're on a horse. There's a horse there. Those are the kind of tanks right there that I have problems with. Those land creepers, I call them. Alright, there's one. Always try and spot when you're on horse. Oh my god, he got deleted. My teammate literally just ran over there and just road killed him. Smushed him to the jelly. Looks like we're all on horseback right now. This is epic. Alright, throwing grenades. You can see that the horse, he really gets tripped up by all the little things around his hooves. It, it makes it difficult. You really have to know, just from experience, what you can get close to uh, and what you're going to bounce off of on this map. Because there are things that'll that'll bounce you all over the place. Oh, there's a guy right here. How did I not kill him? Two grenades on him? Come on, man. Is he going to peek that doorway? He is shooting from that doorway. Oh, grenades. Come on. Give me grenades. Oh, I'm going to die right here. One grenade. I missed the doorway. Let me get out of here. That's a little frustrating right there. I know they're still in this building. There's a grenade. Yes. Oh, and I killed Bill Cosby. Apparently, apparently Bill Cosby likes to play Battlefield. Yikes. I could see some inappropriate jokes about what class Bill Cosby likes to play, but I am not going to. I can't see. There's a tree in the way. Well, I scared him out of the building at least. Let's keep it going. Alright, I guess that means we're going to take C. Oh, roadkill. There we go. Oh, come on, come on. <laughs> Only on Battlefield does some of this stuff happen. I'm inside a building after... Come on. There we go. Get the horse out. I don't know how I did that. Don't don't ask me to duplicate that ever. Oof. We have lost objective butter. This area is kind of difficult when you're on horse. I'm gonna try and get this guy. How did I miss that guy? I have no idea. Charging headlong at the Dreadnought. Yeah, that's real smart. Well, I did get a couple hits with a grenade. I've actually got the finishing blow a few times on horseback uh, on those train behemoths with the grenades. This guy's wiggling around. He probably knows what to do. Yeah, he does. Um, I've got the killing blow on those behemoths before, and those are worth mega points. Should I chase after this? Horses and these little armored trucks are about the same speed, so I can keep pace with them. But I won't be able to close the distance. I need him to go in a straight. Yeah, he turned. Apparently this guy's out for his driver's test. Uh, you can tell I haven't played in a while. This guy's out for his driver. Look at this. He's power sliding and everything. This is perfect. Oh, oh that should have done it. Uh oh, I'm in front of him. That's not a good idea. Let me get out. Here we go. Do the old rope a dope 360 on him. The gun in the back of that thing is really hard to aim, so I'm not going to put much faith in the fact that he may be able to try and shoot me. Oh, that would have been epic. Can't get that one, though. I found pretty much on Battlefield that if, if you push the issue too much, is where you're going to die. Get in, take your chance. If it doesn't work, back out and try a different line and here's where it pays off look at this the truck is completely immobile and ooh, look at that y'all that was a triple kill see that's what i'm talking about i could have chased after that truck for half an hour and that would have made for a truly boring video but i decided to back off let him do his thing 
picked a different route, came in at him. Yeah, you're dead. Oh, another one? Can we get this one? Yep, we got that one. Oh, wow. Horsey just jumped. Made it real epic. Grenades on him. All right, that was a grenade right on him, and it still doesn't kill him. Okay. Yeah. So, what are we going to do now that five is off the table? I mean, I'm still playing one. I still go back to three on PC. What are we going to do now that five just didn't quite pan out? I'm thinking, I'm thinking this is my feelings. They need to go back to a modern shooter. They need to go back to modern times. They need to go back to modern weaponry. We've now had two uh, from the World Wars. Of course, this is World War One, and then five is World War II. Uh, they need to go back to something a bit more modern. How did I miss? I didn't want to take a chance on that guy. So I'm thinking, yeah, they need, they need to be back on something a bit more modern. Oh my god, that guy just got melted. I'm standing on his charred up corpse. We have lost objective I can hear a vehicle over there. Mm, I don't know, should I attack? I mean, this this is all about attack, right? I'm trying to cap C here. C has such a, a small burn zone too. Look, I, I was bouncing in and out of it. Let's head back. Oh, it's the behemoth again. Let me throw another grenades on him. There we go. That was nice. If I'm looking at that correctly. It looks like the behemoth is about a quarter to go. So that means the teammates are putting in work versus the, the giant tank of doom here. Put another one. Oh, it just died there. Okay, there we go. Okay. Tight circles, tight circles, and that's one of those the over the over the left side of the horse strikes. Those are difficult to line up there. Look at this guy. Is he just gonna stand there? Is he he is just gonna stand there? Oh, that sucks. I've been on the receiving end of those before. I've been road killed. This guy? Can I get this guy? Nope. See, the horse... Anyway. Something kind of throws him off and he bounces into things and all of a sudden your trajectory is all messed up. Anyway, we cap and D back. This round is going really well for being my first round back in a long, 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 long time. I'm pleased with this performance so far. Ooh, over the left side. Nice strike. Ooh, don't push the issue here. I'm getting out of here. Ooh, look at my horse. He is hurting. Remember on cavalry on horse, uh, if the horse dies, even though your player could be at full health, you die as well. So you got to be real careful. Let me throw some grenades in here. Don't know why my horse stopped there. These are just little things you get used to on this game. I think there's one up there on the AA cannon. They did spot me. I just heard him. Enemy horse rider. Strike him? Nope. Ooh, grenades on him. Oh, come on, man. Two grenades right at his feet. Doesn't disable the cannon. Doesn't kill him. I'm going to disagree with that one. I can blow up vehicles with these things, but apparently I can't kill troops with these things. What, did, did they nerf the grenades? Oh, yes. Ooh, line that one up from a distance right there. That was a kind of a complicated one. I don't know if you all watched that. I had to waggle the horse around so I didn't... Oh, there we go. So I didn't bounce into things. Oh, he's going to drop a bomb on me? Oh, he tried to drop a bomb on me. So I had to waggle the horse through that one and get the strike lined up and... Yes. To get a strike right, you have to usually hit about two, maybe three seconds before you get to your target. See, I didn't have time to line that one up. Let me go back for him. I've got support. Strike him. Come on. Oh, he's already dead. So it's really difficult to get um, lance strikes in succession. 
you need that you know two maybe three seconds to activate the strike he kind of brings his shoulder back and then strikes downwards it isn't it isn't nearly as fast as the uh, cavalry sword but then again uh, your range is much greater with this oh let me switch there you go that's how it is right there and then he just bounces into something oh my god don't die please The momentum of the horse, it takes him into things. Like, I've ended up in buildings before. All sorts of stuff. Man, this game is just epic, the sounds. Oh, please. Oh! That was a nice one, y'all. Oh, I needed just one split second more to get that one. <clears throat> we are getting some good ones here. Let me throw some grenades in. Going through gas. That's not good. Yeah, you can hear him coughing. It's all popping off up here. There's a couple back behind me. That's why I kind of diverted the route here. Is this one going to stay? Nope, he moved. Can I get this guy? That one died before I got to him. Sheesh. So we got 40 tickets to go. We're absolutely murdering in this round. This is a great way to get back into Battlefield. I feel really good about this round. Hopefully you're enjoying the gameplay. Those of you who come to my channel to watch me play The Division and do breakdowns on The Division, I am not leaving The Division. I'm just want to get a land strike on this guy like this. Urgh! There we go. Um, I just needed to uh, scratch my PvP itch, and this is how I do it. Through Battlefield. Oof. Grenades on him. There's one up top, too. I can't get to him. Can I strike this guy? Nope. Oh, man. Kind of whiffing away out here. We have 15 tickets. Oof. A squad of three, and they got a light machine gun. Oh. <laughs> Whatever. Sometimes you just get lucky. Sometimes it's just about luck. Yeah, this round is definitely winding down. This was a good one. I enjoyed this one. Bravo Battlefield. Can I get this guy to end the round? Yes. And let me go after the truck. And that's it. There we go. A round of Sinai Desert. Man, I love this map. I love this game. Great franchise. Can't wait to see what uh, DICE uh, does with the next iteration of Battlefield. My guess is they got to go back to modern. They got to go back to modern. They got to bring in modern weaponry, modern tactics, all of that. Let's see how we did. And uh, while we're doing that... Uh, if you haven't yet taken the time to do so, please smash that sub button and make sure to click on the bell icon to receive all notifications from my YouTube channel. If you like the video, rate it with a thumbs up, if not with a thumbs down. If you feel like supporting me and my full-time YouTube content creation efforts, check in the video description for links to my Patreon page and Buzz Boutique merchandise store. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter for all my latest thoughts concerning most things gaming related with a heavy emphasis on the Division franchise. And until my next upload, this is Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer, 38 and 1, back on Battlefield.